Hi guys, I am super excited to bring you this fabulous dome card today. Um, they are now available on our website in multiple different colours. I can't remember actually how many we've done. Um, but I'm going to show you how super easy it is to put together and how to decorate it just in your simplest, simplest form. So, what I've done, move these bits to one side for now. So, in your pack you'll have your lid and your box. This is just this bit is just for your dome card. So you've got your you've got your aperture there, which is gonna dome like so. And then you've got your piece of card that's gonna dome as well. So you just fold that in like so. So you're going around your creases, and then you can see that you've got two cuts here. This is for your ribbon. So what we're gonna do is I bent, bent this inwards like this. And then, first things first, I've got my ribbon, I've cut it to about 10 inches long, um, that's just personal preference. So I'm going to that one side, you should be able to see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop it so you can see my nail through the outside, because I'm going to go outside to inside, so you're just going to thread it through, like so. I think this, this ribbon's just... About three quarters of an inch thick, so that's you'd probably get an inch ribbon. So any any thicker you might have to make your your gap a little bit bigger. So I'm gonna bob that there so that you can see that's in now. So I'm gonna do the same on the other side. And I'm just gonna pop that through there. And I'm just gonna use some remover tape just to pop that there. So then you've got your base, right? So your next bit is super easy. So where your creases meet, so you crease for this and you crease for this, you're gonna bob them together. So I'm just gonna use some tape, just because it's the easiest and quickest. I don't know what I'd, I'd do without tape runners. So, we're going to bob that on there like so, and then you're going to fold that one up, you're going to make sure that they meet at the bottom, give that a good press down, and that is one side of your dome card, you see? So when we push this side to meet the line, that's where you get your dome, yeah? So we're going to push this, so we're going to do exactly the same. So I'm just going to move that out of the way. So I'm just going to run a tape, run it down my edges. Make sure it's, it'll hold on there. So again, as you can see, I'm just on the, on the groove, pushing that in, and then sandwiching it up to meet the other one. Like so. So that is how simple it is to put your dome card together. So then, what I've got is, I've pre-cut, I'm gonna cut this as well down for the inside. So I've pre-cut these little bits. So these are, I think, if I'm right, yeah, these are two and a half inches wide by uh, just over eight inches tall. And these, I'm going to decorate my sides with. Oh, I need to trim them. I must have not trimmed them. Right, so two and a half inches wide. And I reckon they need to be about... I'm going to do them seven and a half inches. So I'm going to bob that to one side and get my trusty gutter. Oh, you'll have to excuse me. I've knocked my, uh, knocked my camera down. Bear with me while I get... Uh, Rejigged. Are we back? I think we're back. Very sorry, guys. <laughs> Technology and me, or just clumsiness and me, actually. That's uh, that works too. So I'm gonna do um do about. Mm. We'll take off about that much. 
Oh, that's enough. Let's have a quick measure. And that's about perfect. Right. So, your next bit, what you want to do is, I'm going to cover the inside. So it is, I've not put in inches, so it's 14 centimetres. So what you're going to want to get is, you're going to want it to be a little bit less than 14 centimetres. Cut it on this side just so I can see. I'm going to do 13 centimetres. Perfect. So it doesn't need to fit the whole card, it just needs to cover your dome so that when you bob it in there, you've got a nice pink spotty background. So I'm moving that to one side so you can see. So we're just going to put it together now. So I'll take that back out and I'm just going to put some tape. Oh, I'm coming to the end, I can feel it. I'll have to shout for Michael to bring me another one. <laughs> so I'm just going to bob that in there. Get that good press down. You can always de decorate this bit before you um, put your dome on. I just think it were easy to show you that way. Here. Oh, I can feel it. We are running super low. So I'm going to pop this on here. So this paper, this pink spotty paper is from the farmhouse pack and I know I go on about it. But it's mainly because the, I love the colours in it and I love the fact that they all match. It just makes your job a lot easier when you're putting stuff together. And within the farmhouse range, you get the um, toppers. And I just love the toppers. So what I've done is, this is the topper from the uh, farmhouse vellum pack. So all I've done is it had a white out... out God, white edge around and I've just cut that down and I've put a little hole in the top and just bobbed some pink ribbon to match my other ones there. So what I'm going to do with this one I'm going to form tape as well position that so it tucks under like so so you've got your little ribbony thing you can tuck that in if you wanted to I think it's nice for it to little little pop at the bottom so then same again I've got lovely little uh, top it says have faith in yourself uh, from the same pack so I'm going to I'm going to stick it down now. I think I'm just going to pull on it. Yeah. I'm just going to put a little dab of foam tape. In the middle. She says that's definitely not the middle. It's okay. And I'm going to stick it on top, like so. So when you put it, put it together, just make sure that you just bob, bob that bit in and then it'll pop back up when you've done. So again, these are from um, a different paper pad, but they do, they're the same flowers, so they are in the same range. And I'm just going to bob those down here. Again, this is super simple card. And I think because your card is so fancy itself, you really don't need to do you don't need to be spending hours trying to make something super duper fancy when it's been done for you. Yeah? 
onto it here. You just want to make sure you're not. You're not going to touch your sides because if you touch that crease, they'll bend. But that is my final card. So as you can see, I'll just pop that in there like that. That'll go together and you can tie up a little bow around it. And it'll go nicely into your envelope. Not envelope, but it comes with a box. It comes with a box and lid. I keep saying envelope, I'm used to saying envelope. I'm just going to trim those down. So that, that would be my finished card. So when you open it, it pops open like so. So I hope you've enjoyed that. We've got another one um, coming with the same dome cards very shortly um but this one's a man's one um and i'm super excited so i hope you've enjoyed it and i hope you've been able to see it after his little accident um but yeah lovely thank you for watching bye